Hello and welcome back everyone to Human Resource Machine. We are going to take a look at year 39, the Re-Coordinator. The idea here is to translate a number from the inbox into coordinates in this grid. So for instance the 4 would translate into field number 4 and then into coordinates 0 and 1. So you're supposed to outbox a column and then row. Uh, in order to do that, what you would do is you would divide by 4 which would give you the um, the row number and the modulo would be the column number so in case of 4 4 by, uh, divided by 4 is 1 so you would get your row and 4 modulo 4 would be 0 so it would be 0, 1 but you have to outbox the modulo first as it says in the description and both of these are operations we have seen before so essentially it's just putting them together and uh, minimizing the number of commands um, what I did here is I got myself a counter um, and then uh, basically initialize it um, by copying from field 14, so initializing this with the 0, um, taking from the inbox, in this case, in the first case the 4. Um, if that is already a negative, well, that shouldn't happen. Um, but we need this negative condition in order to um, make this loop work. So um, first things first, you take this from the inbox, you subtract the 15, uh, which is one of the steps you do for the division. Um, basically you subtract um, as long as you can before you reach negative and count each, uh, each subtraction. Um, so what I did is I sub this, the four. Um, if it's negative, we've, we've reached the end. Um, if not, uh, we copy the results to the inbox. So we basically um, keep counting downwards by four each step um, bump up our count so the count will be the result of the division ultimately uh, then we copy it back from the input and loop until we reach a negative once we've reached a negative we um, yeah well we add the 15 back again just to get our initial um, or the, the thing that we currently have an in input we could also just copy from input doesn't matter um, well, to get our original number back, and then uh, outbox. And then we copy from count, which will then hold our division result. So what, what we then have in the outbox is the modulo. So if you go back and look at how we did the, I, I can't remember the name of the room now, but there was one where you have to do the modulo operation. So that's essentially how you do it. You, you basically um, do the same thing as if you wanted to do the division, but instead of outputting the count, of, uh, of subtractions you do, you outbox the remainder after the last subtraction. And in this case it's really just both uh, clumped into one and um, outputting in a certain order. So let's see how that works in, in more detail. So we initialize our count with zero, we take the four, subtract our four, this is already zero, so we can copy to input which is now our um, uh, our row number and then we bump up our count which is our uh, column number and then really we just output well we have to do the division obviously again in order to reach a negative that's uh, that's true um, then we outbox our zero and outbox our one I mean, this was pretty pretty bad example, but let, let's look at the ten. Uh, that's a little bit more more um, interesting, I think. So we subtract the four, we get a six, which is not a negative. So we copy this to our input field and bump up our count. Uh, we copy from the input, uh, subtract the four again. Again, not hitting a negative, so copying that back to the input. And bump up our count again. Copy from the input. Subtract our four. Hit a negative. And uh, yeah, subtract, uh, add again the four to reach our, our input value again. Outbox that. And then also outbox our count. And then just go on like that.
There we go. 14 or 14 steps. And exactly 76 out of 76 for the speed challenge. And that's the re-coordinator year 39. See you next time.